Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to BSOD Gaming. In this video, we are going to be taking an updated look at Vlud's Breath of the Wild Super Hack Tool. When I come over to the Physics tab, you can see that he has implemented a 60fps super mode. This makes it so the game runs at regular speed 30fps in the overworld without the use of GPU fence skip hack and when we enter shrines we get the full 60fps that we could before. Let's enter this shrine now and see what the transition between 30 and 60 FPS is like. Keep an eye on the FPS counter on the top of the CMU window, you will see that the FPS is about to dynamically change from 30 FPS in the overworld to 60 in the menus, making loading much, much faster also. Now that we are in the shrine, you can see down here that the game is running at full speed and also at 60 FPS in this shrine. The best way that I have found to demonstrate the fluidity of this 60fps mode is to turn my camera and show you the difference between 60fps on and 60fps off. As you can see, the camera stays turning at the same speed, but when the 60fps super mode is on, it is much much more fluid. Ok, let's turn back on the 60fps mode and head back to the overworld to show you some more advantages we can gain from using this tool. When we come back out of the shrine we can see that the game has returned to its previous 30fps. This footage is all completely uncut so that transition took place exactly how it would in game for you. However, another advantage that we can gain from being in this 60fps mode is, when we go to our map, it is still running at 60fps and it is a lot more fluid to move around within it. The same thing can be said for moving around within the inventory screen. As you can see above, the fps is at 60, however Link's animations in the inventory screen are locked to normal speed. I can honestly say that after playing this game for 200 hours, that using the inventory screen at 60fps is a much much better experience than at 30. Ok guys, that's about it for this little update on Vlud's Breath of the Wild tool. As you can see, he is adding more and more wanted features by the community, however we do not yet have a set release date for it. Once again guys, cheers for checking out the video, I hope you found it informative. Remember to like it if you liked it, dislike it if you didn't, and subscribe to the channel if you want to see all future videos from me.